Hello viewers, this is Just Fake Network TV, a place where you can get the latest information about Nigeria news and all the news in details. President Buhari signs the most important bill for 2021 into law. President Mohamed Buhari on Thursday in Abuja signed the 2021 appropriation bill of 13 trillion naira into law. The president's action followed the earlier passing of the bill by the National Assembly on December 21st, during an emergency section convened for the purpose of passing the budget. The signing of the budget is also in line with the president's promise to return the nation to, to January to December budget cycle. The budget estimate was increased by the sum of 504 billion naira from the estimate of 13 trillion naira presented to the joint sitting of National Assembly by the President, Buhari, on October 8, 2020. The signed budget comp comprises total capital supplementation of 1 trillion naira. Statutory transfer stand at 496 billion naira, recurrent expectations of 5 trillion naira, and gross dom domestic projects, GDP growth rate of 3%. It also provides Three trillion naira for debt servicing, while five trillion naira is for the current expedition, and four trillion naira for capital expenditure. The president also signed the 2020 finance bill into law. Those who witnessed the signing of the budget include the vice president, Yemi Oshiba, the Senate President Ahmad Lawa, and Speaker of the House of Representatives, Femi Bajabi Amila. Others are the council chamber were the secretary to the government of the federation, boss Mustafa, some cabinet ministers, as well as few top government officials. Well, so viewers, what do you think about this? What is your own take about uh, what uh, our president just uh, issued out right now? You know, according to what we read, we can see that he actually signed a huge amount of money, a huge, I mean, a very huge amount of money so hmm, i don't even know what to say about this present administration because the reality is that they keep on signing bills and bills and bills upon bills and then um, there is no difference there is no positive changes in this present economy in nigeria economy this is to tell you that they are insensitive government a government that does not feel the flight of the people and they forget that we are the one that actually voted for them. And we were hoping that it was coming to fight corruption, not knowing that it is coming to encourage corruption, not knowing that it's coming to even embezzle money, to impose difficult and hardship on Nigerians. A lot of things is going on in that country that is not right at all. Look at the case of Apabio and the others slapping donators. All swept to the carpet. You know, the slapping senators, killing of armless protests, seeking for better Nigerians as well as insecurity. In fact, this is not a good thing at all. They keep signing P bills upon bills, and uh, there is no positive imp changes in Nigeria. You can imagine the huge amount of money that this present administration has signed into bill. May God help us. Look at them, the bunch of corrupted set of people. Making things hard for Nigerian citizens. You know, and the funniest part of this is that the one signing and those witnessing the signing of Bill, they will be the one to enjoy the, the, the benefit. They will be the one to enjoy the benefit. May God help us. You can imagine more than 3 trillion naira. Eh? That's, not a, that's not a small money. More than 3 trillion naira just to service debt. Ah, not repaying, you know. Not even to repay debt. Almost the size of capital budget has been signed into bill. After they have borrowed and borrowed and borrowed a huge amount of money. May God help us. Nigeria is in a big debt. Is in a big, in fact, we it is just only God that can help us. 
it is only God that can help us with this with this each issue of signing bills and nothing is being done about it and there is no positive changes in Nigeria all they need to do is just to sign bill and that is the reason why I said during that time when they were saying that uh, Nigeria should go back to lockdown again I know that there is something that is coming after it something they want to do something they they have another plan that they want to achieve and here we are we nigerians are suffering the poverty rate in nigeria is increasing every day the insecurity is increasing every day the killings do the same thing kidnapping the same thing but all they can do is just to sign bill and after signing the bill it does not is is it's not going to help we citizens at all Just imagine whooping three trillion lost debt servicing. Ah. May God help us, my sister, my brother. Nigerian leaders is nothing to write home about. In fact, it is nothing, absolutely nothing to write home about. May God help us. So viewers, what do you think about this? What is your home take? Kindly drop your comments at the comment section below. For those who subscribe, we want to say a very big thank you to you for subscribing. We say God bless you. And if you're yet to do so, kindly press the subscription button below. And also, please don't forget to press the notification button so that whenever we upload news, you will definitely be the first person to watch our latest news anytime, any day. God bless you for always being there for us at all time. We appreciate you all for watching our video. We say thank you to you. Have a lovely day. Stay safe at this crucial time. Bye.